Hi everyone, it's Brittany from Fine Tune Pilates. Today I'm going to give you some tips on how to fine tune your sideline leg lifts. So this is an exercise I typically see people do wrong. Um, so we want you to get the most out of that hip work uh, because it's really tough. So let's take a look. We're going to come down onto our right side. So if you're watching at home, make sure you're on your right side. Okay? My beginners, I want you to leave your bottom leg bent and keep your top leg long. If you're a little bit more advanced, you can take both legs long, sort of balancing on your right side. Okay? So hips square, just like headlights, so the hip bones point forward. Okay? You want to think about stretching both sides of the torso really long. And then you can just leave your left hand on your hip for now. On your next exhale, we're going to start to lift that top leg, left leg up, and inhale down. Exhale, lift that top leg up, and inhale down. Exhale, lift, and inhale lower. So keep going. You're going to lift just about a foot and a half off the floor. So you're not doing some sort of crazy 80s workout video leg lift. Okay, you want to just lift about a foot and a half. That's all you need. So I want you to try this. Take your hand, find your bottom two ribs and your hip bones. Place your hand in that space. So when you lift your leg, you want to feel like that space under your hand is not changing at all. It stays exactly the same. So if you lift your leg too high, that space under your hand scrunches up. We don't want that. We want to really just stay in the hip. So really working those abductor muscles. So exhale to lift and inhale to lower. Now, these are so effective if you do them right. You should feel this already after a couple reps. All right, really feeling the work from the back half of the body. Okay, so if there was a line straight down, you would feel this work behind that line. Think about the seam in your pants. You want to feel the burn behind the seam in your pants. Good. Exhale, lift. We're going to do a couple more just to really drive this point home. You want to lift the leg only a little bit and then back down. Last time, lift and lower. Bend both knees and give that hip a little pat. Ooh, that does burn. All right. So next time you're doing leg lifts in the gym or at a Pilates class, think of this video and really get the most out of your hip work. Thanks so much for checking out my videos. Don't forget to have a look at my blog for more health and fitness at www.ftpilates.com. Thanks for working out with me. Bye for now.